Picture this, the van is finished. We've been traveling Europe for a few months. It's fantastic, the sun is out. We are camped up next to a beach in south of Spain, but we've run out of bread and milk. Hmm, I don't want to pack up the van. I don't want to have to put the tables and chairs away and lock down all the cupboards and drive to the shop. John, do you think you could go to the shops for me? It'd be better if we had a bike. I can help with that. This is the new BK6S from Hitway. This is an electric pedal assist bike, which is road legal in the UK, but we're gonna be taking it with us when we go away and it's gonna change our lives. So, I thought we'd have a look at some of the features of this bike now. As you can see down here on my right hand side, I have got a seven gauge gearbox. And at the moment, I'm just tootling along in second. I can shift up to third. And down here, you'll see my speed is a very comfortable and easy five miles an hour. Now, if I shoot up through the gears, obviously it gets more difficult to pedal. I'm up to six miles an hour. But what I'm able to do now is press the plus button and this will give me my pedal assist. I have three levels of pedal assist. One. Now that's just like someone has come up behind me and started pushing me. Now I don't even feel that I am pedaling. My feet are moving around, but the bike's just going on its own. That's taken me up to now nine miles an hour. If I press again. Whoa. Now there's two people pushing me. <laughs> up to 12 miles an hour. We'll just get around this corner. Then I press it one more time, up to th third. And as you can see, we are doing our maximum speed at 15 and a half miles an hour. My feet are moving around, but they're doing nothing. But if I stop pedaling, then the motor will stop and I'll start to slow back down again. Oh, I just hit the brakes there. And it instantly stops the motor. And as soon as I move my feet again, oh, it's, yeah, it's like someone's pulling me really, really fast. Whoa, 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 whoa. This thing's got some serious power when it goes. I'm just gonna try across the grass. Wow, absolutely thundering it across the grass here. <laughs> that must look shaky from your point of view. And there we go again. It's incredible. I have to admit this thing is absolutely fantastic. I'm in love with it and I'm glad I finally managed to get it off John and have a go on it because he's on it all the time at the moment. As you can see the battery power, can you see down here the battery? We've lost one bar of battery power and we have had this bike out all morning filming for this video. So the battery on this thing is a 250 watt and it takes five or six hours to give it a full charge, so very easily overnight and it gets about 21 to 56 miles per charge. Now that obviously depends on hills, terrain, your weight, many, many factors. But so far, it just seems to go forever for us. Wow, this thing really does shift. 
<laughs> so a couple of other key features. It's got um, great suspension down on the front forks. The seat has also got a uh, nice suspension under it. The tyres are a very beefy 20 inch by 3 inch, so they're incredibly comfortable if you go off-road at all. Now it might be a bit restricting on a road normally, but because of the pedal assist you don't even feel it. So the bike also comes equipped with uh, front and rear disc brakes, which is uh, essential when you're going this fast. Now I have to say, for the money, this thing's incredible. I do believe it's one of the cheaper options for an e-bike out there. And uh, I'd say it's worth every single penny. It's absolutely phenomenal. Now this leads us on to something else I'm going to show you in a bit. We have actually ordered some extra parts for this bike. Now because it's road legal, it's restricted and it's a pedal assist bike only. If you were to buy this bike in certain other countries, it actually comes with a throttle. There is a port here. It's got a three pin port on the front handlebars there for you to attach a throttle. Of course, you add the throttle, it's no longer road legal in the UK. This doesn't matter for us because we're leaving the UK and we will only use it with the throttle when we're in countries where you can use it with a throttle. And just like that, I'm back at the van. Another little feature it has, if I press and hold the down button, the minus button, it goes into push assist. So now I can walk and I don't even have to push it. It's moving itself. Then once we get back, I can just hit the brakes and that turns off the pedal assist. And we've got a convenient little stand. It also has front and rear lights, which is another reason it's legal here in the UK. And in order for that, we have to press the plus button for a few seconds. And the lights come on. And we've got rear lights there as well. And the rear light is obviously also a brake light, which is fantastic. Once we finish with that, turn the light off. Yep, that's off. I can turn the key, pull it out turn the battery off. The pedals push in and fold away. The handlebar, quick clip, undo, fold down. The main frame, if I undo the lock, undo this clip, pop the stand out of the way, and there we go. This thing is only about 30 kilograms and it goes straight in the back of the van, really easy. And we're a few days later, the parts that we've been waiting for have arrived in the post, we fit them to the bike, but now we just need someone to test them out. Me please. So the most exciting thing we fit, obviously, is this accelerator. What it is, is they give us a half handle that's fixed, and half is an accelerator, and it just connects in to the socket that was already there on the bike. Now if John twists the accelerator and lifts the wheel off the floor, <laughs> so we still have to have it in the pedal assist, one, two, or three. Obviously, we just put it in three, twist the accelerator, and off you go. So as you can see, that makes the bike loads more fun. But I should stress that is no longer road legal in the UK, so we're not gonna be using it here, or at least we will, but we'll take that off until we go abroad. And then we've got one other little addition to show you down here. These are little footrests that I've added, and now these are for Ella, so she can ride on the seat on the back. Now sadly, Ella isn't here with us right now. We're gonna take the bike back to our house and we'll show you her riding on those pegs. So there you go, what a fantastic little gadget, hey? We are gonna have so much fun with this thing in Europe, I can't wait. 
Now, if you're interested, of course, there's a link down in the description below. Also with a 30 euro discount if you use our discount code also down below. Don't forget, tune in on Saturday for our regular vlog and we'll be getting on with another review next week. See you later. Bye bye.